Right then, what's going on dudes? How you do? Welcome back to some Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 mods, and today we've got ourselves another character showcase, showcasing my character, Lucario, which is basically just the Saiyan version of, of course, Pokemon Lucario. You, you guys see the d similarities there? <laughs> Anyways, so we also have a Mega version. This is the one that we're actually going to be using, because it is, if you can tell from the stats, it is noticeably better. So yeah, it'll make the video a little bit shorter, because I know uh, YouTube tends to prefer shorter videos for some reason. I don't know. The skill set that we are using, Partial Shield, Raid Blast, Pressure Sign, because it dodges everything, Supercharge, Silver Dragon Flash, shoutouts to Unleashed on that one, old-ish mod, still good, God Punisher, Spirit Explosion, and Super Saiyan All, shoutouts to Lazy Bones. This is the SSB E Super Saiyan Blue Evolution variant, and it is the one that I felt was most fitting for this video. By the way, guys, this is like my third attempt at this, and I'm not kidding, because the first time I left this on the whole time, because why wouldn't I? And then the second time, I, I just I m didn't mix the audio correctly because I'm smart and do stuff like that. So hopefully this time it works. Oh boy. Anyways, here we go. Those are homing. Those are homing key blasts. Of course they are. All right. Off to a great start. So hopefully I'm not going to have to do this again. Not that it really matters because I love making videos for you guys. Speaking of... Not really anything I've talked about yet, but anyways, we, Fowlers, we are almost at 500 subscribe. That 500, that, I don't know, guys, that just seems, that seems like a lot of people who like to watch me play video games. And I got to admit, that is really, that is really something else. I'm not sure if you guys are crazy or if you guys actually do like watching. Uh, regardless, thank you so much. I really do appreciate it. And I hope that I'm going to be able to make content for you guys uh, for the near future, at least. It looks fairly uh, fairly stable. That is a very annoying evasive. Wow. There we go. Okay, two down. Two to go. So, yeah, again, I never, ever talk during... Uh, character reveal showcases, whatever you want to call them. Like, during character showcases, we'll call them. I never really talk during them because I like to focus and do challenges during them. So, yeah, this time, a little bit different talking. That's fine. Oh, that's mean. That's very mean. Oh, boy. Okay, I didn't think there was any way out of that. That... Okay. That was close. That was too close for comfort. All right, got to keep better track of my my mans here that I'm trying to take down. Good grief. Anyways, what was I saying? My goodness, that was, that was I'm not going to lie, that was a really impressive escape. Um, talking, yeah. Yes, commentary, no commentary. Down in the comments, fellas, if you want me to talk more during commentary videos, uh, sure. Down in the comments, please do let me know, because uh, I, I obviously can't know what you guys want if you don't tell me, so. Yeah. That would be nice to know. Just to give me a good idea of what uh, videos are hopefully going to look like for the near future. Anywho. Oh, fellers, I have a good idea. Here, we're just going to do the world a massive favor here. Oh, yep, okay, there we go. Mm-hmm, bop, mm, boom. Take that. Oh. You guys know why it's a big favor. It's because Ribrian's annoying. Ah, changed my mind. Who, who, who thought that Ribrian in Xenoverse 2 would be a good idea? Like, seriously, did anyone actually want her? At least the transformed version? Like, for sure not. Maybe the first version, but not. No, oh crap. Close. Definitely not the transformed version. She's just so obnoxious. Anywho. I am kind of curious to know now how many people actually wanted because there's gonna there's gonna be someone in the comments of this vi or someone else's video who's asked the same question. They're gonna be like, oh, "How dare you, Ribrian's my favorite or whatever." Uh, good grief. Anywho, oh no, that missed. It didn't miss. Oh, the combos. Let's go. That was uh, the Punisher Shield missed, but um, Zeno got the. What is that? Blazing attack? Yeah, that's blazing attack. Zeno got the blazing attack, and that hit, which is, uh, 
Another really cool looking skill, not gonna lie. Okay, we got Frieza, other Frieza, new enemy, and Cabbage and Jeets. Great, yeah, this is fair. So we got characters I can beat in my base form, and we also have characters that I can't, definitely cannot beat in my base form. That single character being Vegeta, obviously. Why do you have so much power? Because unlike you, I actually train. Well, I guess you train for however. You, you trained a tiny bit in Resurrection F, but that doesn't really count because you died right after. Ha <laughs> funny. So Saiyans are the only characters who get Zenkais, so now I am actually, or at least to the best of my knowledge, I haven't watched, or I haven't read the manga at all, and I'm not, and I'm not up to date with it, so don't, 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 don't say mean things for me not knowing things. Um, but to the best of my knowledge, Saiyans are the only characters who get Zenkais, so how exactly did Frieza catch up with, like, 15 years of experience in four months. I'm a bit confused on that. Talking about Resurrection F, by the way, in case you didn't know. <laughs> it's a grab. That's such a mean grab. That's such a mean grab. Kind of, okay, it's kind of hard to see when it's uh, the the animations for it. They're very they're they're very subtle and quick. Those two words don't normally go together. Jeets. My man Jeets, I'm gonna go blue and I'm gonna do the fun. Take this. Oh, my man's with key charging and I missed! Oh, come on. Wow. I'm gonna have to try again then, won't I? Oh, I thought he was gonna use an ultimate there. Hang on. Is he, is he learning? Careful, it's learning. Team Four Star reference. Please watch DBZA, guys. If you haven't heard of it, seriously, watch it. It's really good. Team Four Stars DBZA. Tempted to leave a link, I probably won't though. You guys can just go literally just Google DBZA. Team Four Stars version is the like the first thing that'll come up. It's pretty good. Anyways, there goes Cabbage. Why did rocks go flying when he hit the ground? I'm confused. Okay, who's next? Oh yes, Hit, Kefla, and Goku. Blue Goku. What fun. Can I land a stamina break in two hits? Nope. Three hits, though. There we go. I don't think you can do a two-hit stamina break out of that move specifically. I, can't, I actually want... Yeah, you can do a two-hit. Oh, how'd that... What? How'd that land? Oh, my goodness. That's pretty impressive, actually. I didn't know you could land that. I guess he must have... Oh, does it hit twice? Oh, it might, it must, the only explanation I can think of is it hits twice, and he just wasn't blocking for the second hit. Interesting. Let me guess, ultimate, hang on, try again, ultimate. Wow, okay. I was, hit, hit, can you go away for a second? I'm not fighting you, I'm fighting Kefla. Oh, there's the ultimate. Mine's better. Takes a, it takes a setup, though. It takes a bit of a setup. How do you set up Kefla's ultimate? I'm actually kind of... Hmm. How do you set that up? Do you just use it or what? Because, like, every beam attack normally has, like, you stamina break and then knock back, and then it does just fine. This isn't a beam attack, but it sets up the same, and I just missed because I'm very good at video games, as you guys can clearly see. Also... The time skip Molotov, I don't think you stamina break if you do a heavy, a heavy back it like I just tried to do. Not sure, I've never seen that ha I've never stamina broken out of the Molotov though, so that's kinda, kinda confusing. Come on, there we go, good grief. A lot of burst dashing, my goodness. Hate blue evolution, cause it looks cool. Yo, that looks dope. Custom aura, by the way. Link, again, links to all the mods I use in the description, because it's very important that we support the modders who create mods. It's just like supporting content creators on YouTube. You support them so they know what you like, and they make more. It's a win-win for everyone, really. Oh, great, both my teammates are dead. What fun. This is going to be hard. No, it's not. Okay, nope, 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 nope. 
No, ah, uh, go, do stuff. Because you keep uselessly using ultimates right in front of me. That's why. Oh, just like that. That was close. That actually almost hit me though. And omen, because it looks cool. That's the other side of the ads, just because it looks cool. Also, that animation looks so clean. Even five, five years, is it five? Yes, five years later. If it's not five years, I'll correct it in the ed editing. Also, that was a bit of a Team Four Star reference, if any of you got that. Oh, that's going to miss now, and that's going to hurt a lot, which it didn't. Okay, I might actually be screwed here. Okay, I'm dead. I'm not dead. That fuck, that did a lot more damage than that. Two more of those and I'm dead. Fun. Okay, crap. Yes, I know the secret to beating Ultra Instinct Goku. I can't exactly do that if I don't have health or stamina. Also, I'm dead. Shoot. Well, that sucks. You can't win them all. I think that might be the first time I've ever lost uh, in a video. Okay, nope. Anyways, once again, I don't know if I've said it before, but if you guys know of a mod that gets rid of that, please, please tell me. It's so annoying. Bulma's so annoying, just like Ribrianne. Anyways, next video. Gonna be another character reveal uh, type video. I might talk during that one, I might not, I don't know. A yes or no commentary down in comments. Uh, I would very much like to hear you guys' suggestions for... Uh, video plans in the future and just video ideas in general. By the way, we are almost at 500 subscribers. 500 of you guys are interested in watching me play Dragon Ball. 500, yeah, that's a big, that's a big number. I honestly wasn't expecting to get this far at all. I mean, my ultimate goal is a thousand, but I wasn't expecting it, so I very much appreciate the support that you guys have shown over the last few months. So yeah, I'm going to leave you guys with that, and I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day, or evening, whenever, whatever time it is for you guys, and I will see you next time.